What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, TMG Raccoon, here with another episode of Halo MCC. And this episode, actually, we're playing Griff Ball. Because, um, Griff Ball is in the rotation now. So, we're gonna just play Griff Ball and see how we feel afterwards. And if we feel like playing SWAT, we're gonna play SWAT. If we feel like playing, I don't know, Firefight, we'll play Firefight, but. Ugh. And sorry for um the really weird uploads lately. Things are kind of getting weird, and not really with the whole YouTube side of things, but with uh just how me and the other guys are feeling. Like lately, everyone hasn't really been feeling themselves, and a lot of personal shit has been going on in our lives. So. We've all kind of are a little bit weird right now when it comes to mindset, I guess. I can't speak on the other guy's behalf, but I know for me personally, ah, I don't know. Shit's feeling weird. Um, now, nah, like I said, not when it comes to YouTube. Shit's pretty normal when it comes to that, but ah, you know me. I'm just trying to keep everything going. But we'll just enjoy ourselves and have fun. And, uh, yeah, Griff Ball. Well, the, technically it's not Griff Ball, it's Ricochet, but... Eh. Yeah, it, oh, well. I'll have the same origins. It's pretty much Griff Ball's cousin. Ricochet. It, it normally ends up with us just clashing with the enemy constantly. Whoa, take him out. Fuck yeah, team. <laughs> Fuck, this game's game mode's fun because it really teaches you uh, swordsman the shit. Enemy has the ball. The enemy has nice. The ball. Ball. Are you going to come for me, motherfucker? I see you. I see you. I scared the shit out of me. I looked next to me and my dog's head's peeking over the arm of the chair and I didn't expect it to be there. I want you, mother... Gotcha, bitch. Uh oh. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> Hey. Oh, I swung too early. Normally what I do, if there's another elite in the game and I'm playing as an elite, I normally target the elite, show dominance. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? You wish, bro. Okay, I gotta play the smart now that we have the ball. Okay, give me a pass. Give me a pass. Fuck it. A hard one. <laughs> Fuck a duck. <laughs> I was proud of that one a little bit because it was so pitiful. It was a pit and it just bounced on it. The enemy has the ball. What the fuck? All right. Got that guy though, I didn't even mean to. Ooh, so Griff Ball isn't the more, I wouldn't say exciting, well, it, it's exciting, but in its own way. It's, I find with people, it's an acquired case. Like me, I don't know, I like crashing into people like this. Cause you, when you guys both have like swords, you both hit each other with like speeds and like, well, insane speed. You guys hit each other like a fucking truck. Oh, I barely missed. But, I just want to get a quick throw off. Oh, that buddy. Y'all are... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, that guy just walked past me. New ball spawn. I was confused at what just happened to be there. Oh, and viewer chat's open if you want to chat. Fuck you, buddy. Your team dropped a ball. The enemy See, has the ball. In games like these, I don't usually play like 
Well, me and my me and my cousins fucking dominate at this game mode. Like it's fucking awesome. But what we do? Fuck you, bud. But what we do? Cause me, you guys, if you guys have seen any of my videos, Rocket League, any of that shit, y'all know that I'm not really a. Uh, I'm more of an enforcer than anything, so I always just try to, like, thin the herd of the enemy out, personally. Ball. Just to kind of, like, set them back and punch a hole for my team to the fucking enemy run has through. The, ball. the enemy has the ball. Bitch. The enemy has wow, I thought my buddy would have had that guy, so I made a last second decision to fuck him up. Now, hello, Zang Healy. Fight me like a fucking man, bitch. Or get absolutely destroyed by one of my guys. Yoink! <laughs> Suicide. Fuck you guys. I'm out. New ball spawn. Ball. See, nor the the, yeah, since we ball. have are pretty much leading it, I'm just gonna get kills. Because at the end of the day, kills give me points. I got a goal or two. I gotta throw in and a run it. Ball. Not even the a problem. Enemy has the ball. Ball. Wrong. You, you, have the ball. you wanna play that game? I can play that game too. The enemy has the ball. And I just gotta stall them for seven minutes. Shit, I didn't realize we, only, we had still had seven minutes left. Okay, that's it. Oh, fuck. He jumped up real quick. But we're gonna keep him back. I don't fuck up this stuff. Yeah. Triple kill. Triple kill. And yeah, this game mode, it's all about how you fuck the other team up, because normally what people do is do the whole jump up method, but for a lot of people it just does not work. <sighs> this game mode's kind of relaxing sometimes. I know a lot of people who find it aggravating, but I don't mind trading shots. That's one thing that Robert doesn't like, is trading shots like this. The how you dash at each other 99% of the time. Okay, guys, they're catching up. We gotta fucking finish this. Oh. The enemy has dropped the ball. Hey, would you look at that? You have Yoink. The Hi, motherfucker. Oh. oh. The enemy has the ball. See, all we need is just a good enough team where we can get closer. Goalkeeper. That was a long dash from me. The enemy I'm gonna watch the, the net. The enemy okay. has the ball. We all can't be here. The Does one of our fuckers AF? God damn it. The enemy has the ball. Five minutes remain. Well, I just gotta keep him out for five minutes. Ah. Fuck. Yes. Maybe they need my sword up here too. Keep the thirds. Keep the herd thinned. I'm almost going for that fucker right there, but I just gotta keep my eye out. Point score. I don't know what the fuck that one guy is. But we just gotta win this. Um. At first, I was like, ah, but now I'm like, what the fuck is my team doing? The enemy has the ball. I'll play it safe. Run ins aren't our concern at this point. We at least want to throw it in a couple times. That's easy. It's easier to get a throw in, obviously, than a. Good try, bud. 
But now we have the ball. And we lost the ball. Woo! Double kill. Sorry, bitch, you jump. Where do you think you're going, buddy? Where do you think you're going? Goalkeeper. We both missed. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> See, you really hit each other like trucks in this game mode, because you just fucking nail each other, one goes flying, and the other one does too. You fucked up, you idiot! Oh, <laughs> fuck, who just punches a dude with a sword? We're gonna lose because of my team. They are not playing it smart. The enemy has the ball. Yeah, I don't know. I When I have the ball, I don't go for the fucking punch. That's the way to fuck your team up. Won't come for me, saying Healy? Come on. Come on. May the best elite win. May the best elite win, bitch. Yeah, that's right. Fuck you. You got distracted. You guys are just gonna... Point fuck! <laughs> Enemy nearing victory. New ball the enemy. Fuck you the guys. Enemy if you guys can the do the job team. done, I can. You have the ball. Hopefully. The enemy has the I just ball. Missed my thing. Fucking Christ. Fuck. <laughs> that wouldn't get to that ball, anyways. My team's fucked. Come on, go, bud. Ball. The enemy Fuck has the off, ball. We made that f that's the old Halo Reach friend pack thing. If you're teabagging but not on a body and you're looking at a guy, that's friendship. Fuck up. The enemy has the ball. One minute left. That's it. Point score. New ball spawn. You have the ball. Okay, I got one chance at this. I really can't fuck this up. Oh, I could throw it off in time. The enemy. So I did fuck ball. it up, and we are the gonna enemy lose. Has the ball. But. It's okay. It's the left. first game of Griff Ball. ball. Fucking douchebag. First game of Griff Ball. And it's not a, Well, we might do this for the whole episode, but we also might not either, because I the just enemy. play in it back and I haven't played Griff Ball in a while. Have the ball. Ten How'd that not yeah, there we go? Five, four, three. We just I got another one. one. The enemy has the ball. Game over. Fuck you, dude. I'll teabag just cause I can. I'll be the douchebag now. See the hall I'm always like, oh why the fuck would someone do that? I started to give her a try. Piss someone off. Normally, I don't do that shit unless I have a comeback, but yeah Gives a fuck that one time Ugh. Which I don't know I'm trying to find what other videos I want to do today. There's nothing really I want to do I know the things you guys want to see but lately. I don't know Don't know what to play or, I know what to play, but I don't know what to record. But, we're gonna try my luck in SWAT. Add some modifiers. Or, not modifiers, but add some game modes. And, here we go. 
No, if I didn't accidentally choose free for all, because that would be unfortunate. No, I didn't. I had to look at the stream to make sure I didn't. You guys would be amazed how many times I accidentally, uh... Stop, my own complete social matchmaking game. Sweet. But you guys would be surprised how many times... I already forget what I was saying. Oh yeah, when I accidentally choose a free-for-all SWAT. Or like free-for-all any game mode and get fucked up. But I last time I played free-for-all SWAT... I think was on stream and I did not do that bad. But, we'll see. Oh yeah, I also gotta do another- I'm doing another episode of Halo, like the campaign. Pretty- I'm not sure if I'm doing it right after this or what, but I just wanted to get some Halo MCC in, cause it's been a while. Alright guys, Halo multiplayer. And then we'll get back to the campaign. But, for now. Oh! Next episode of Halo MCC is gonna be a fire another or is gonna be a firefight uh, episode. So if you guys like firefight, you guys could check that out. SWAT, kill the enemy so, team to score. Since this is Halo, might as well talk about Halo. So, fucking Halo Infinite has been delayed till 2021. And I was at first pretty pissed about that, considering- Oh, I thought there was a way behind me, but at first I was pissed about it. Because I would just want this game to be out and all of that shit. I want it to be- I, I just want to experience it as a Halo fan. But coming from a critic standpoint, I am kind of glad that they're taking- their time with it only for the fact that uh covid has i'm assuming fucked up a lot of development for the game and fuck up a lot of shit and i'm really wanting this game to come out i guess complete and not feel like stuff's missing or feels like it was underdone i want them i'd rather them take their time with it and make a phenomenal fucking halo game than rush it and speaking of which, with the whole Halo Infinite being the next 10 years, that does scare me a little bit. But what mainly scares me about the whole Halo being 10 years, like, I guess not having to worry about a, ha uh, like a mainline Halo game for a while would, I guess, be beneficial. And what I'm hoping is that it opens up the opportunity for a shit ton of new, um, I guess, spin-offs. Like, I don't know. I really, I'm still hoping that that Blood Horror game, ever since I heard a Hidden Xperia talk about it, is literally all I can think about. Because I was like, that's a fucking million dollar idea, is a Halo Flood fucking horror game. And for years, uh, I've been waiting for an open world Halo game. And now that I'm actually going to get it, I am excited beyond all belief. Oh, I don't know what the fuck just happened there. And I'm I, what I'm also hoping is that... Oh, fuck, there's a guy right there. But with the multiplayer aspect, it's free to play. But I'm hoping the, I guess I'm really saying what every, well, at least I think everyone's fear is, is the whole, like, I'm excited that Halo Universe gets to get expanded to a bunch of other people who have never, probably never experienced Halo before. But I just don't want microtransaction to be a huge thing. Like when it comes to armor customizations and all that shit that Halo's been known for for years. Don't make that fucking, um... Hey, I got double kill. But don't make that fucking pay you to fucking look good type of shit. Make it like Halo Reach and all the other Halos ever in existence and make it where map packs and shit cost money. Maybe at, since it is a 10 year long uh, Halo experience, why not? Because yeah, there's going to be free updates and shit. 
But if you're gonna replace microtransaction, because obviously you still gotta make money back on the video game, come out with like DLCs that you pay for. Like none that's really. Maybe it could be like an ODST on Zeta Halo, or you're playing like that, and you might could be playing the same world. Or do it like Fallout, right? Fallout had it pretty good, and have like maybe a DLC we go back to Reach or something like. That's not too half bad idea to me, at least. I think that would be a good idea. But then again, I don't work at 343, so I don't really don't really know the shit that they have. And now that they have this whole new engine too, that opens up whole new possibilities for spin-offs and different games that you know, of course, are Halo Universe. Like, I want to see a Halo game. All from the Covenant's perspective. All from, like, the perspective of, uh, Zhang He Li, or maybe you get to choose between Zhang He Li or Gerald Hane or whatever you want to play. I feel like that is kind of a cool idea. And experience the Halo campaign. Like, kind of like a Halo Reach thing. Get make Give me a Zhang He Li that maybe I can customize. Maybe I can fuck with. Or a Gerald Hane that I can do that with. And, either, and like, make it from the Covenant's perspective, or maybe do the same thing, but with the Banished and, you know, experience a whole bunch of Banished things. And I'm also deciding, as I'm talking, what the fuck I want to get in the tier. But I settled for a Needler. Glory and an honorable death. Which gives them brutal. See, this one's cool and all, but, oh, looks like we're going. I don't know, I have so many ideas for a good Halo game, and like, a good Halo anything. I don't know, I just have so many thoughts and feelings about this game. And I'm not sure if you guys don't like it, or you do like it, me ranting, or talking, or just spreading my views about what's going on in the Halo world. Because I tell you what, Halo is going to be a big part in this channel. Like, it's going to be one of my long-running main series channel, I'm going to make sure of it. Even if it's this multiplayer series, and it's, I'm especially excited for Infinite. Like I said, even though it is delayed, I'd rather them take their time and come out with a great fucking game than half-ass it. Because this is a game that us Halo fans have been waiting for for a long time now. And they don't want to butcher it. That's all I know. They don't want to fuck it up. If they fuck it up, it can jeopardize, A, the brand new Xbox that's being released with the game. And having this game as its flagship video game. That, it could jeopardize that. It can jeopardize how the fans view Halo. And it can jeopardize how f big Halo is. And it used to be a big game and everyone was like, oh, Halo is so good. And oh, a multiplayer Halo is pretty fucking phenomenal. Like this Halo 3 multiplayer was the shit I was rocking as a kid. And it was a good fucking time. Ah. Paid too much attention looking around that corner that I didn't even see the guy run out from behind a box. But yeah, I just wanted this Halo to be phenomenal. I also wanted to bring it back like eSports. I want Halo to go to the eSports side of the thing. <coughs> They have Rocket League, they got all these shit that's all these sports. Halo used to be, and then it fell. 3 for 3 kind of fucked that up. But... Fight me, bitch. Oh, there was more! <laughs> They just fucking showed up out of nowhere. I swear one's gonna come up there to see who's down here and try to shoot one of us. Oof. I love the multiplayer series though. And I know I rant a lot in the campaign series too, but the multiplayer series just feels like... I can fucking talk about whatever the fuck I want to, and it's not taking apart of a story or any of that. Oh, did I mean to kill that guy? Okay. Well, I, c I did, but didn't at the same time. I don't know, it was weird. Hmm, make sure the no one was there. 
seems like they're all in here. Oh, and I'm interested to see what your guys' thoughts on the new Halo game coming out or anything. I did got a double kill, what? <laughs> or I'm just curious to see your thoughts on Halo and what do you guys think they can improve on? What do you think they can add? What things do you want gone? Like, I'm curious to see what your guys' opinions are. Because I know my opinions on Halo, but I was going to go for that plasma carbine, but didn't know people were there. But no, I'm really curious to see your guys' thoughts on Halo. Because I know a lot of other people's thoughts on Halo. And they're like... Well, they're, they're, they're varied, obviously. Like, I know people who love the sprinting, love the armor abilities. And I know people who just fucking hate them. Right? And personally... I couldn't give two shits if sprint and all that shit is in a Halo game or not. And... Halo Reach armor abilities, I, I I quite enjoyed them. Like, I didn't dislike them, but I also didn't really like them because there's a lot of things that it affected. But if it's just Sprint, like, I see they have Sprint in the new Halo Infinite. If it's just Sprint, and if it's, like, all that shit, I can do that in real life. I don't care. It just, I don't know. Like, a Spartan obviously can do that shit, cannon-wise and all that, because, A, the armor enhances their movement and all that shit. They could, they, they could do it, like sprint and mantle and all that shit. I just find it adds for more fluent of a gameplay, right? To be able to fucking jump over shit and we traded shots. And even be able to like, yeah, I'll, just, I'll try to find an example in this game. So you can't, never mind, there's people right there. But you can't like jump over obstacles in this game. Well, you can, like it's more like a hop. But to be able to actually like pull yourself up, I don't know. And sprinting, especially in open world, I feel like it's necessary. I know people who are like, oh no, it's not necessary in Halo Infinite. Well, I don't know. I feel like it is because it's an open world. You gotta travel quite far. You douchebag. I will get revenge. Never mind. But yeah, that's that's added. <laughs> that's part of my Halo rant today. I probably got more things to say, but if I have more things to say, I'm gonna say them. But um, no, I'm just hoping that 343 is. Oh, I wanna. S I can't wait to see what the air vehicles are gonna look like, and if Halo's gonna have water vehicles. I don't know how that's gonna work. I think. I don't think they'll have water vehicles because hey, we've never seen water vehicles. In Halo before, but I don't know. I think it'd be it, it's interesting to see how this new game comes out. I am pissed about the Magnum and shotgun thing. I'm not sure if I've talked about that yet on my channel, but that pisses me off. But knowing 343 and if history has taught us anything, is that by us bitching and complaining about it and how much we don't want the pistol and the shotgun to whatever to disappear i feel like they're gonna add it later on in the game like if it's if it's not there on release and if it's not there like in the beginning after they realize their mistake and whatever the fuck it's gonna be there later because so many people are bitching about it especially like the classic of the shotgun and the sound of the magnum obviously i can't you know replicate it perfectly but oh how can you get rid of that iconic of weapons? And th they did it in Halo 5 with the fucking Sleep. RPG, right? But they brought that RPG back. Fucking thank God. And I'm pretty sure they're going to be doing that with uh, the Magnum and Shotgun. Like, they have to. You, they, they can't. 343 can't be that dumb to Halo. Because... I don't know. Like, it, it, there are things that Halo need to feel Halo. And if you're adding new weapons, go right ahead. Halo, there's always room for new shit. Don't replace the shit with good shit that the battle tested, the shit that the fans have loved. Don't replace that with fucking dumb shit that everyone's like, what? That's so modern warfare type of shit. 
But it doesn't overly bug me, because whatever. I'm giving 3 for 3 the benefit of the doubt here. Like, I like to play Devil's Advocate with Halo. I can see why the community's fucking pissed off. Trust me, there are things that I'm like, that bullshit. But I can... I, I, some, some of the things that the community are getting mad about, I'm like, it's not that big a deal. Like, I get why you're upset about it, but in, in, in the grand scheme of things, I don't really give a fuck about some of the And if I can think of anything, I'll let you guys know, because I, you guys are probably like, what does Julian mean by all that? Well, I'll, I'll think of a good example, because right now I don't really have one. Pretty much because my. I need to find a day where. Actually, I need to communicate with you guys. Um, because I want to do a stream. I don't know if it'll go on YouTube or anything. But. I want to do a stream where I just play Halo multiplayer, probably SWAT, probably whatever. And. You guys ask me questions about Halo, I answer them, and we just talk about Halo and what we're excited uh. for, what we're not excited for. Um, just pretty much shit like that. Uh. Bitch. Uh. Fuck you, bud. Y'all bitches are trying to flank me, eh? Not if I fucking help it. But yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's what I want to do. Just one long stream. Where we don't worry about time limit because of YouTube. We don't worry about any of that shit. Because I know a lot of uh, my viewers are like, Oh, why don't we stream longer than 30 minutes? Well, some videos I do. But it's mainly for YouTube convenience. Because with a lot of my shit, being a new YouTuber, people aren't really going to sit around. Because unlike big YouTubers, us guys who are just starting out and just trying... Or uh, uh, girls too, I guess I should say. Us people... Sorry, it's 2020, raccoon. No. No. But us, pe us people trying to, um, I guess, build our channels and become YouTubers. And pretty much to get viewers and people to like us and shit. We are under, I think, pretty much a bigger, like, like, microscope. Like, all the big YouTubers all obviously have gone through what all the small YouTubers go through. But no one is, at least not that I know and what I've experienced with people watching my videos, not a lot of people want to sit there through an hour-long video of a new YouTuber. They don't, since they don't know us, they don't really have that place in our heart or in their, in their heart or mind for us. So they don't really give us that chance. But that's why I like to keep it. 30 minutes. If people watch that full 30 minutes, good for them. But if they don't, then it's not a big deal either. Um, fuck you, dude. But I know there are some of you who actually do like watching my shit. Right? And do like watching the longer videos. Because I do have a few of you... You douchebags. I swear to god I'm gonna kill that guy because that's the same guy who fucking team killed me last time. It's fucking Christ. Anyways. <laughs> no, yeah, no one really gives us the YouTubers a chance, but... There are some of you who do. And I really appreciate that. Oh. Betrayal. Yeah, how does that feel to kill me, bitch? Hey, I was dealing with something, blue guy. Jesus Christ. Can't you see? Bitch. I think it was embarrassingly long how much hard I tried to punch that guy from behind, but we just were moving the same fucking speed. Ha, huh, he did. So I don't take shit for team killers. When it's someone team kills me, I team kill them until they're one team kill away from getting booted. And then I hope or I taunt them until they shoot me. And then I pray they get kicked. I have 12 kills. Sweet. I didn't even know. Hmm. Oh. 
Huh. So see, it looks like, as far as I know, they're hiding up in the buildings. Got you, bitch. Even though you got me, I just spawned and shot you in the face. I'm proud of that. Oh, and, uh, yeah, uh, speaking of being a new YouTuber, that's the reason Raiden stopped really being on YouTube is because no one was really giving him the time of day. Like, me and Robert are lucky enough where people have given us the time of day. Right? You guys, we have subs, we have people who watch our shit. Not, like, these, I don't know. We, we don't have any, like, hardcore people watching our videos. So, like, oh, yeah, Raccoon. Dino guys, they're, like, they're really good. We don't really have those people. Like, I have a few people, which I really appreciate you guys. Just, I'm letting you know that right now. Um, I do have people that say my content's really good. And I do have, I did have one person tell me that I am their favorite streamer. Which that honestly melted my heart. And really made, hey, I got the final kill. Fuck all you. But, it really melted my heart. You guys, like, even though we're short in number and we're, you know few but you guys do make me you know warm my heart make me feel good and you guys you know really show me that pe there are nice people out there in the world because you know not to get like too sentimental but i haven't really met a lot of nice people in my life so i'm glad to see that there are nice people out there and i'm glad you guys are enjoying my content and i'm hoping that you guys can share it with your friends you know subscribe like all that good stuff it really helps you know helps me out a lot and especially being a small guy, it kind of gives us that boost that more people can see our content. Because all I want, I don't really want to be famous. I don't really want to get all this YouTube fame that, like, PewDiePie or something has. I just want, I don't want to make, I just want a community where all of us gamers can come hang out. You guys can ask questions. You guys can suggest games. I'll, pr I'll play them and all that stuff. And I want to have a community built up of people who just... Are tired of being judged. Are tired of living under a microscope, and are just want to have some fun. And that's why, personally, I'm not sure why Robert does it, but I know personally that's why I uh, say in my bio and all that that if you guys watching our stream want to join, you guys can. We don't care who you are. Well, if you want to talk on the mic with us, you at least have to be 18. I'm not sure if I've ever said that. But if you want to game with us, we don't care. You know, just. Uh, Say, hey, I'm interested in gaming. We have a slot open. I'll ask for your gamer tag and we'll get you. We'll, we'll invite you and all that. And you can just come play with us and see yourself on stream and whatever the case may be. Because I just want a place where everyone can be happy, not judged. And we can all just, you know, enjoy the things in life. Little things in life. Like, video games is a great way. You know, it's a great way for all of us to relate to each other. Because it's like, oh... You like this game, I like this game, me too, and, you got, and people can bond over that. It's like a, a good starting point of building, like, I don't know, I'm just looking to build a friendly community where everyone can just come hang out, have fun, and all that good stuff, you know? And I just hope that I can put smiles on some of your guys' faces Well, I'm doing all of this too, because sure, all, all I know is that you guys put a smile on my face, so I'm hoping I can give back in that sense. But... I won't go on any longer with this mushy gushy stuff. I'm not sure how you guys feel about it, but I'm gonna end this episode here. It was a good one. A lot of talking. Fuck, I talked for pretty much 40 minutes straight. And it was a good time. That's why I like my Halo MCC videos. But, um, expect the campaign shortly. Or more MCC multiplayer videos. I'm probably gonna be doing a lot of Halo today. I'm in a really Halo mood, so hope you all enjoyed. I sure did. And and if you did like, leave a like, subscribe, comment. Like I said, if you comment your favorite things about Halo, things that you're looking forward to, things that you don't want, or all your worries, your hopes, all that good stuff. I really want to see them, and I can't wait. Hope you all enjoyed. See y'all in the next one. Peace.